Hey guys, welcome back to our series. I'm recording this again after the last episode. So if you do have questions, go ahead and put that down in the comments before we get going. And that way, tomorrow I will answer those uh, if I'm recording this then. I don't know, I might record more tonight because this campaign is super, super good. Uh, but I'll be making videos consistently for quite a while, so if you have any questions, go ahead and throw those down in the comments. I'll be down there responding to them anyways, so yeah. Recon Team Bravo reporting in. Three and six in position. It's starting to get crowded up here, Cat. So we're closing in. Report to any Covenant structures or devices. Direct action may be necessary. Copy that. <laughs> when Cat runs an op, direct action is always necessary. Here, you may need these. High velocity, armor piercing. They'll take the hat off an elite at 2,000 yards. And they ain't cheap. I'll be in touch. And there we go. We are already in the game. And oh my goodness. The sniper looks so good. Alright, you ready? So we can melee all these guys. Keep quiet. Alright, I don't know how they woke up, but they did. Armor lock there. What else we got? I'm gonna go with the active camouflage this time around. This is a callback mission to Halo 1. The third mission in that game was also a stealth sniper mission where you got an absurd amount of sniper ammo. Um, and it was also... You know, it's supposed to be somewhat quiet. Boom. Oh, totally, totally hit all those shots. This is fun. Just picking off targets. All right, somebody's getting closer. You are there. I see you. Stop moving. My PC accuracy still isn't all there. Because, of course, we've just been playing the campaign. Um, getting that practice in. But, you and me, guys, we are... forgot that was a camo, not sprint. But just a reminder, we are... Slowly but surely becoming PC gamers with the Master Chief Collection. So, right in time for Infinite in the fall. Alright, let's get, uh, missed, missed. Alright, got you. I really like sniper missions. Sniping in Halo is one of the best sniping experiences, especially in multiplayer, where it's just the, the high skill, high reward kind of sniping. You know, one shot, headshot, you gotta get good if you can do it, especially no scopes. So good. This music is fantastic, by the way. Stop moving. Alright, I need to stop wasting the sniper ammo on the grunts. Seriously? I swear. Alright, let's get an assassination in. Oh, no, never mind. Alright, looking for ammo. Whoop. I forgot, you can drive the forklifts in this game. 
Because, you know, it's the only way to be cool. There is night vision, but I don't know. I don't like the night vision in this. Some dead people. We got pistol ammo. Uh, there's a shotgun. Everybody needs a shotgun. June, where are we going? I don't recall where we're going. I think he's just following me. I figured out where we were going, guys. Alright, drop you. Is a sniper? Maybe that's June. Alright, drop you. Come on. Come on. You gotta be kidding me. Please, just die. Thank you. Where's all? A lot of yelling right there. Alright, here we are, guys. Continuing right up to this. Like, it just looks so good. And these are the giant beasts. Uh, if you've never played this campaign, this is uh, Wildlife. And they are absolutely phenomenal. They have the faces of elites, for some reason. At least in my opinion, that's what they look like, but... These are hostiles. We do have to fight them. But only after we let them kill all the grunts. Alright. Let's, uh, let's start to step in a little bit. He's dead. Oh boy! Wasn't counting on that one. I was thinking June might uh, do something there. Did not. Alright, let's just make this happen early. It'd help if I could actually land some shots. Come on, June. You dead? Stand there. Stand there. Alright, he's dead. What about the other one? The other one is dead. You're good to go. There's a grunt. Now, right, come here. Nope. Come on. Come on. Turn around. Bro! No, there's a wall there. That was such a great shot. You stop. Quit your shooting. Of course, in Halo 5, for whatever reason, you can't actually shoot out the turrets or the people or anything like that until their scripts are finished. As they, you know, jump. Jump from the. Oh, uh, what's that called? Phantom. Dear Lord, having a day. Let's see, out here blocking my shot. And I don't have any grenades. I do remember this firefight map. It's one of my uh, one of my preferred firefight maps in the game. Just me personally. I don't know, something about it. It's simple. It actually feels like you're holding out a little bit. Of course, I prefer the ODST firefight to this game. Uh, just me personally. Alright, please give me that. As much as I like camo, I'm not really using it. Also, in this game, you can actually uh, recharge your shields while you're sprinting. Can't do that in Halo 5. Give me that. I'm going to take that. And then I'm going to take that. I'm going to steal it back. Classic line right there. Let's just take a good look real quick. Obviously, like, the weapon models, as we've talked about, like, sniper rifle looks phenomenal, but it just looks, it looks so good. Alright, let's, uh, you go there, and you go there, and then I'm going here so I don't die.
Come on, you're dead. And... Alright, perfect sniping position right up here. Now, this this mission does go quite a while, if I do recall. Because uh, there's fighting here, then we go to another location where there's hunters and there's dropships, and then we go uh, to the Spire area, and the Spire is essentially the next mission, and that next, next mission is also quite long. But we'll get there when we get there. Start with dropping these guys. Oh. I'm so good. Look at that. Basically a Halo Pro. Basically a PC Pro. As I miss shots at a grunt. This guy here. You gonna die. Come on. Missed every shot. Got you. Got you. And where are you at? Phantom. I'm assuming we go this way. Aha. See, I remember things from back in the day. These lights look pretty well. It's really weird because this game looks great. It has come on, June. I was talking. You gotta, you gotta do that to me, bro. Classic scene. And it's very much like uh, the the beginning of Halo Three, dude. But now, as I was saying, the. Uh, the game looks good. Like, a lot of the textures are good. The issue is, like, some of them definitely show that they're nine years old. And because of that... There we go. A little emitter. Uh, because some of them are, you know, clearly nine years old... Did I get the sniper ammo? No. Man, words are so hard. So this game looks good, right? Like, like it... Everything about it... You know, the 4K, uh, the enhanced graphics, like, they look phenomenal, but some of the textures definitely show. Um, it, it, it's kind of like you don't notice it until you really see one, but occasionally some of these textures, like, the rocks aren't awful. Like, those are fine. Um, like, I'll just point one out as I see it, but the textures can get rough, at least in my opinion. I think uh, the game still looks good. Like, I think it's, you know, very exceptional for being a nine-year-old game uh, coming to PC for the first time, but... You know, it just makes you think, like, you know, obviously Halo 1 Anniversary comes out next. An Anniversary, like, those graphics will look good. Should just assassinate the guy. I don't know why I didn't. You know, the Anniversary graphics will look good, but just imagine, you know, the, the 2001 graphics. You know, it's like, yeah, 4K, cool, but at the same point in time, you know, my toaster's gonna run that at 4K. Alright, where we got? This, of course, is the multiplayer map, because uh, Bungie wanted to essentially streamline a lot of the work when they were creating this game. So what they did, if you don't know. So what Bungie did... Oh, oh that's a grenade. Man, words are so tough when you're fighting, man. Okay, so what they did uh, is they created areas for the campaign and for Firefight, and for multiplayer, all in one go. So earlier, obviously, there was a, a Firefight map that, you know, is... Let me defend this, that's what I'm doing. You know, it's a Firefight map, and it's literally just ripped straight from the campaign. This is a multiplayer map, and it's literally just ripped straight from the campaign, and the idea is that if they're building this area that you can use in all three, then you're not, you know, wasting time developing one for each. And it's, it's not a bad idea. But they didn't always make for the best maps. In my opinion, 
Reach's maps were somewhat unbalanced at times. They weren't the best. Like, like there is plenty of room to be desired. Is that is that a saying? Room to be desired. All right. And... Nope. Yep. There's room for improvement. That's the biggest thing. Like, it, it definitely wasn't perfect. I don't want to die. This works in one of the games. I don't think it's this one. Okay. It's like, how do I drop it? It's F. And I missed that shot. How did I miss that shot? One of them's dead. Oh, that one's dead too. Yeah. Russ. Buck Miller. Mick. Alright guys, this is uh, the end of the mission most likely, so I think I have a little bit longer to go. But uh, just in case I forget... Yeah, because he's got to open that. It's coming up here in a second. But uh, just in case I forget to say it at the end of the video, uh, I do want to thank everybody that's been watching. It is phenomenal being able to play this game on PC. It's an amazing experience. Oop. There we go. Yeah, so it's been a phenomenal experience. Obviously, i got to focus on my aiming, so I'm not the greatest at commentary. But, uh, yeah, thank everybody for just watching. You know, this game looks great. It plays great. And, you know, I'm excited to become a PC gamer. Get away from the console. The land of console plebeians. Just joking. I'll, I'll, I'll always love Xbox. Oh, you dead. I'll get up here. Pistol, that works. No, you can... There you go. You're dead there. I, I do remember when they uh, first implemented, you know, the head bobble of getting shot. Uh, you know, I was playing... You can play the Halo Reach beta uh, with ODST. And so there's a little drop down on it. And it... The head bobble was just amazing to me. I was like, wow, they could actually program, like, a part of your body reacting when you, you know, shot it? Like, that's... That's revolutionary. And obviously, like, nowadays, it's kind of like, wow. You know, the things we thought were really cool... But no, I, th I still think that's really... I, like, I just get excited every time there's improvements to something like that. Like the head bobble getting shot. Like, that's really cool. Uh, I'm really excited to see what Infinite has, but... Alright, this guy is, is the end of the video. I'll let this cutscene play out. Thank you for watching. Um, if you do want to see more, hit that like button. Uh, go ahead and comment any questions. I'm going to be down there talking to all you guys. Uh, but until then, I'll see you in the game. Chatbot. Transmitting visual. You've seen this cat? Confirmed. Receiving Nova 3 and Nova 6 live visual of a Covenant strike force. It's no strike force. It's an invading army. If we're gonna smother this thing, we need to go in hard and fast. Agreed. All recon teams disengage and fall back. Sun will be up in a few hours, and it's going to be a very busy day.